Hey guys, this is Ayush. You are watching Extreme Android, and in this video, I'm going to show you some top 10 powerful root apps. So, without wasting any further time, let's get started. So, the first app in our list is Dumpster. If you ever wanted something like Windows Recycle Bin or on your Android smartphone, this is the app to go with. Root permissions plus this app is equal to Recycle Bean. So, this has a deep scan mode as well, which is like uh, you can recover your photos, but this isn't that helpful. Uh, this just shows images out of your cache memory. So let's delete one foot picture of mine and let's see how it works. By the way, we surpassed 1000 subscribers just now. Thanks to everyone who subscribed to my channel. So as you can see, it's here and let's restore it. And the best thing about this is if I click on restore, it will be saved to the same path where it was. So the second application in our list is Solid File Explorer. This is a simple file manager application that can help you uh, edit your or you can make any changes in your root directory with this application. If you wanted a file manager something like this, this is the application to go with. So the ne next application in our list is Cache Away. So this is a simple application. Uh, when you open it for the first time, it will ask you to configure a list, which basically asks you for what you want to clean on this clean on clicking this clean on button. So as you can see, these are the things you can select there. So if I just click on my clean all button, it will clear all the cache of my applications. Dalvik cache, you don't need to go into recovery every time to clean your Dalvik cache or cache memory. So the next app in a list is Accubatory. This is not a root app, but certainly this is a power user app, and this is one of my favorite application. This is the first application I install on my every fresh install on custom ROM. So you can see your charging speed, discharging speed, and in the notification it shows your lifetime discharging speed as well, real time discharging speed as well. So the best feature I find about this is it's free and as you can see, it calculates battery health on your charging and discharging ratio. So this tab is my favorite history tab. Uh, I use many custom rooms. So this is the tab I use every time to see how much screen on time I'm getting. The next app in our list is Drive Droid. So this is an application that can help you make your device bootable in your PC using an USB cable and root access. So you are in an emergency case where you cannot create a bootable image, bootable drive like something like pen drive or CD. You can use, use your smartphone and USB cable to make a bootable Windows ISO or any live Linux or Linux something like that. So this is an application to go with at that time. So the next application in our list is Migrate. So this is a very powerful backup tool and this is one of the application that I use to switch ROMs frequently if you are something like you if you are someone like me who switches room uh, very frequently this is the app to go with you can back up everything like from app to their data and the permissions as well so you don't need to do anything once you back up and restore so this creates a zip file and you can restore it by twrp uh, after first booting after booting your room for the first time, go back to TWRP and restore this. Install this as a flashable zip and you are done. So the next app in our list is AF Wall Plus. This is an Android firewall application that works with root. As the name suggests, this is a firewall application that helps you block internet access to an app. So there are many non root alternatives there, but they use VPN and this is the USB for this application with root access you don't need to connect to any type of VPN to block internet access so let's block Chrome so after selecting three of them click on enable firewall and then click on apply and let's try if the internet is blocked or not let's try opening a website let's open google.com so as you can see the internet is blocked in this application so the next app in a list is launcher this is a launcher application which is very highly customizable launcher that has support for android 10 gestures but to get that android 10 gestures you need to either install quickset or install it using and something like uh, 
magisk module so i will link it below install a magisk module and you will get that in return just as well the next application is called permission ruler this application can come in very handy to those people who keep thinking about their privacy on their android smartphone so what this app does is as soon as you lock your screen it will revoke all the permissions from your installed apps and as soon as you turn on your screen again it will uh, grant all the permissions back to the application so that they can work normally as they were so this is how this works and you can obviously whitelist apps in this in case if you uh in case if this application messes up with some applications notifications or something so that is it so the next and last app in our list is servicely this is something like greenify but a better version of it with better user interface in my opinion and uh how this works is is very simple it's like one click operation you just need to open this application grant all the permission click on hibernate all apps and you are done it will do its work automatically and you can of course whitelist apps in this as well you can whitelist apps activities as well so that you don't mess up with the notifications or something like that so that is it for this video if you liked my video please like the video please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new here and that is it for this video thanks for watching and i hope to see you in my next video